So hello everybody and welcome to a new Power Week video. It is December, it is Christmas and it is Power Week. Can it be any better? So in today's video we're going to talk about the new reporting features. We will talk about the aligning feature, we will talk about the uh, tooltip for buttons of uh, you know Matt Allenton, we will talk about um, Yes, the highlight versus filter. I have some comments on that. So let's begin. Corval Tech News and Power Week. Okay, so this is the Power BI update 2018 December uh, desktop update. And we're going to go through the reporting features, my favorite reporting features. So the first one is gotta be alignment and visual. So this is the same experience that you would find with PowerPoint, where you know you move something around and you see the guides, it guides you through the elements that are close to it. So now I can align this visual with that one and that one easier. Oh, I moved that one, but no, it's no problem. Up. Oh, you can see that it's smaller. Mm. But now that is aligned, so it just makes it easier. You had the possibility to do that here on Format Align before, but it was a lot more work. This is gorgeous, beautiful, well done. This was done by an intern at Microsoft. We love you. Hire the guy. Really good. Okay. With that said, we move to the next um, uh, update, which is tooltips on buttons. So if you have created a button, let's do it. I'll show you how it does. Uh, I don't know. Let's use this bookmark. We want to use it as a home uh, or, or as an in information um, button. So we go there and then you click here q a and you say this is a bookmark and it shows so you could put there like uh, you know for help call it or email me uh, whatever you like so that would be the way to do it the next one it is uh, not a big thing. They just change the icons for the highlighting filtering uh, between visuals. Let me show you. So there are two visuals here. So when I click on uh, something on element on one, it just cross filters the other visual. It's been there from the beginning. Okay, so that's not a big thing, but um, the default setting is to highlight. I've actually changed that, but the default settings for this is always highlight, something that I it bothers me because it, it takes so long time for me to change that. And 99% of the times I want it filtered, but what to do? The, the default, I wish that there would be like, you know, a setting that says, which one do you want to have default? And, and so, so I could change it. But this is not what the update is about. The update is about actually the icons that they've changed the icons. So this is highlight and this is filter. So if you want to, uh, Instead of highlight like it's here, if you want to filter it, you just click on that. So it is a great reminder of this feature in case you didn't know. And then if you want to affect the behavior that this one has when clicked, click on there, you see, highlight. You see nothing, absolutely nothing. And if you're working with make models, it happens all the time, all the time. And it's very rare that you want to see highlight. Most of the times you want to see filter, but either way, you click there and it filters, so you can actually see the the data, the graph. So those are the report features, the highlight of the report features on Power BI Desktop Update. December 2018, which one is your favorite? And what do you think about this highlight, fil uh, highlight or filter? Which one do you prefer? Uh, just curious. I'll see you again tomorrow. Tax Fridays. Don't miss it. Bye. So hello there, do you know that I publish Power BI videos every Monday, Wednesday and Fridays? So make sure you hit the subscriber button and the bell to receive notifications every time I do that.